Hi, I'm Stuti Mishra. I am the Independence Asia Climate Correspondent and I am in Dubai for the United Nations Climate Summit. We're checking out what some of the experiences they set up and one of them are these air pollution pods which are designed to replicate the levels of air pollution in different cities of the world. So in this pod we're in London and London has dangerously high levels of night NOx including diesel. So what you're smelling is actually meant to simulate the diesel, which um, the London government is now trying to take measures to improve the air in the city, including by introducing low emission zones, but a lot more needs to be done to make incentivizing public transport and introducing renewable energy systems. So we are inside the Denny Ford and I can immediately feel the difference. I can see the visibility is down. You feel the heaviness and you feel you can smell the smoke, you can uh, smell the transport when you stream, you can, you can actually also feel the heat because they have repeated the temperatures as well. We move towards Beijing now. And you can see Beijing also has a very low uh, visibility level inside the port. You can see there's visible haze, there's temperatures which are closer to Beijing. People often when they enter from London to Delhi, they only deeply realize that they, they are coughing and that they are not feeling well. And nobody is staying here for long. Amazing the worst. The last one that you went through, uh, the air had the worst smell on it. Delhi was the worst, I think, just because of how hot it was. And was it closer to what you've experienced in Delhi? Uh, yes. And my goodness, it's quite revealing. You know, you really feel a sense of, um, well, quite intimidation as you go to New Delhi and uh, and uh, Beijing. It really is quite thick air, difficult to breathe. And then you go through and you go into London and at 20, whatever the number was, it was pretty refreshing. So it really made you feel the difference. You can come out of those pods and uh, you can get into one of these uh, clean ones where you get a sense of what the air is supposed to smell like and feel like uh, it is closer to the safe limit of WHO. And this is an experience that has been designed to raise awareness about air pollution and to remind people that it remains a very important climate issue as well. <laughs>